so I just crashed through the barricade and kept going and then I was chased by the police heading back towards the border and we went back, waited across the road, there was a cemetery, we waited in the cemetery and that afternoon saw the little girl come down the road, coming back from school, heading home and just as she arrived we got out of the car and grabbed her. Keith Schaferius is Australia's longest licensed private eye. Dubbed the Retriever for his work finding and recovering children who have been abducted, usually by one of their parents. I know it, it would have been a difficult case to uh, succeed. It would have had to have been a real commando-style uh, entry and commando-style raid to get those children out. He's been shot at, chased by police, thrown in jail and even posed as a movie producer. The uh, case in Yemen involved a lot of uh, preparation. We had to find the children and then set up a, uh, a sting. We set up as a movie production company and uh, in fact uh, prepared a script. It was a script from an old movie entitled Return to Aden. The movie company we established was Hollywood Capers, was in fact registered in Hollywood. His missions have included clandestine meetings with CIA contacts, arranging forged passports and winding up on an international wanted list. Rescuing children is not for the faint-hearted, and Keith always asks how far a parent would go to get their child back. It can be quite dangerous. Uh, I've met with danger on many occasions, especially crossing borders, not going over uh, the border through the regular crossing by finding my own secret crossing. For example, between Germany and Poland, I was able to find some old uh, border crossings that were still there from World War II. 